Hi Hoopers! I'm going to be teaching you today how to do this move. Prerequisites for this move is a walk jog and a wedgie kick up. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a really strong walk the dog. You're going to want to know exactly where it's going to be coming back to you so you can stop it with your foot. So that should look like this. So you're going to stop it with your foot. So what you're going to want to do now that you have stopped the hoop with your foot is you're going to take your other leg and hook it around the front of the hoop and then hook your foot at the bottom. Right now you're going to feel some tension in the hoop. It's going to feel like it's kind of bending between your legs and that is a good thing because that tension is going to give the hoop the momentum to come back up. So what you're going to do now is take your foot out and the hoop should come up at you. So you're going to want to play with this a little bit to kind of see how much tension you have. If the hoop keeps doing this to you and not coming up high enough, that's because there's not enough tension in your hoop. You're going to really want to feel that bend and if you even make it bend a lot for like one second right before you do it, it will come up really high. So play around with that and figure out what works best for you. Some ways to transition out of this move would be to catch it right here and to go into smears, which look like this. Another thing you could do to transition out of this move is to stop the momentum with this arm behind you and let the hoop fall. So let it fall and then go into some folding and whatever else. So, let's speed that up. If you guys have any questions about that, you can comment and ask me. Also, if you guys use this in any of your videos, please tag me so I can see what you guys come up with. Thanks for watching.